Hi, this is Keith from Lanes and Grooves. Today we're going to do a quick overview of the um, Palmetto State Armory uh, AKGF3. Um, this one here is the one I've been taking. I want to add little, little things on here and there. Uh, but uh, this has the Mokov stock on, which is just a mag pull part, which has an adjustment back here. You can pull it out and adjust the length on. I seem to like that, and it's also a folder, so you can hold it right here, fold it over, and still shoot it like this. Uh, so this gun is uh, it's really well built. I think there's been a few uh, gun tuber channels that have really kind of knocked these Palmetto State Armory. Um, the one thing is these have a forged trunnion, unlike some manufacturers that do not. Um, that if you do your research online, you'll see that the forged trunnion is very important for the EK. For this one here, I put a a um, the rail up on top of it so I could put a Vortex Crossfire. And uh, this gun has run flawlessly. Um, it feeds pretty much anything as most AKs do. Um, I put a aluminum four grip on here, right here. And that's to the bottom of the, I think it's Magpul grip, Magpul stock, Magpul um, four grip. So uh, this gun runs no problems at all. Feels good in the hand. The fit and finish is excellent on this um, gun. And uh, I, you know, I have zero complaints about the, the Palmetto State Armory GF3 AK-47 Mokov. Um, I believe this gun right now is going for 7, 729, 759, something like that. Uh, and mainly, I think the reason why that is is if you look up what the difference is between GF3 and GF4, it has to do with different features as far as barrel linings and things like that. But uh, that'd be something for you to research. Um, so uh, what I did notice right away is some of the polymer magazines um, tend to, on this gun, tend to uh, be late difficult to get in the polymer ones. So they're just a little stiff, that's all. But... Uh, uh, the, it seems to like the uh, metal magazines a little better. None of them have had any sort of feeding troubles or anything like that. Uh, the gun is run flawlessly. The fit and finish is great. The color match. There's no rust spots anywhere on it. Uh, and the parts is a UTG Pro rail I put on here. It snaps right on the side right here. And there's a release. I put right on the side of the EK. Um, as far as assembly, this assembly I've taken this apart a couple times. It's no problem at all. There's no... No difficulties taking this apart. It's easy to clean. I mean, not very many people even feel the need to clean their AKs. But I still wipe this one down. Um, the Mokov has um, QDs on the rear. QDs pretty much everywhere on the side over here. And there's a QD I put up front of here from Bravo Company. Um, so at the end of the day, <clears throat> if you're looking for um, an initial review of this, so far, so good. I think the gun is, uh, you know, a quality build. So we'll see how it goes. And, um, you know, I have a couple other Palmetto State Armory, uh, just one or two of the AR platforms, um, kind of just knock around guns. And I think this will fall in the same category. Um, no problems with any of those. No problems with these. I think the fit and finish is really good. Uh, and, of course, you're using Magpul parts and stuff to... Uh, like I said, so far so good. So I would certainly look at, if you're looking for something that has the capability to have folding stock, shoot it as a pistol style. Um, and, uh, you know, you, you want something in this setup. Uh, I would certainly think of, um, you know, the, the Picolino State Arbory. The warranty is excellent. So check on the website and you'll see what I mean. Um, yeah, I've had zero problems with this. And we're going to do a quick review in a little bit. Uh, after we get to the range with it, it was like, so it's been a little while since I've shot this one, but we will do another review in a few uh, episodes here and we'll be back. But uh, yeah, so this is Keith from Lane the Grooves. This is the Palmetto State Armory AK 47 Mokov. Um, take a look at it. Uh, the price is reasonable for it and does have forged trunnion. A um, lot, a lot of features here that you're not going to get with other companies. So take a look at it and, uh, you know, uh, give it a chance. Thank you. This is Keith from Lane the Grooves. Have a good day. Please subscribe.
You ready? Ready. <laughs>